Okay, thank you. Thank you. Thank you, Ruth. We want to welcome everyone to our third episode of Stereotypical Topics. I'm the Narcoleptic Correspondent, and I'll be your host. And this is where we talk about the A-listed stereotypical topics, uh, most interesting, uh, bizarre, strange, or even the most boring topics. Thank you. Okay, and now just a quick update about our last episode. Uh, a lot of viewers wrote in about Hill. They were really concerned, our last episode being, uh, Our Vampire's Real. And just to reassure everyone, Hill is alright. He was actually doing great. And, uh, and I'm sure he'll, he'll appreciate knowing that everyone was so concerned. And it was really after uh, SCT jumped in and uh, whatever action bit, the mosh, you know, when he jumped into mosh, uh, the, the two of them chased off the vampire. <laughs> Just so everyone knows, Uriel's whereabouts are currently unknown. Oh! So, just my suggestion, keep your doors locked, your windows locked. This, we still don't really know if he's really a vampire, but um, there's a strong likelihood. Okay, so today's topic is, are werewolves real? Oh! Yeah. After all, the two topics go hand in hand. Oh! Oh! Not literally. But, you know, werewolves, vampires. <laughs> so, um, let's get to our lineup of guests today. Okay. So, so today we'll have our very special guest. Have our very special guest, Jacob Boggin, a well-known ladies' man. <laughs> Frost Top from the band Top Tracks. Yeah. yeah. Great guitar player. Ah. And we'll also have one of my uncles, Uncle Fuzi. <laughs> and lastly, Mickey, one of our studio camera persons. Okay, let's get to it. So, let's first talk about werewolves. So, in history, well, they're also known as lycanthropes. Kind of the idea of lycanthropy, lycanthropes. Shapeshifters, you know, they generally only the one shape, but they shape shift two wolves from human. Uh, they seem to go back as far as ancient Greece, um, as far as writings go, and, and mythology, and you know, just the legends. Other historical mentions are from Native American Indians, um, Russians, yeah, surprise, um, well, you know, old, old countries there. Uh, there's German legends, old English legends. I mean, pretty much a lot of your um, European countries had legends about werewolves or some type of sheep shifting type of creature. So, it's got to make you wonder that, that many countries, uh, those many different cultures all believing in the same thing. It's got to make you wonder. Oh! Could they be? Hmm. Well, once again, you decide. Okay, so let's get to our first guest. Okay, uh, first guest, Jacob Boggin. How's it going? Our ladies' man. Yeah, yeah, welcome. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, so Jacob, you're a ladies' man. That's what they tell me. Well, why would you say that is? I don't know. I I do have three wives. Well, not technically, but they act like wives. I <laughs> see, and they don't mind sharing you. Of course they do, but they all seem okay with it. Hmm? Wow, that must keep you really busy. Yeah, but I don't know. It just seems like I have incredible energy lately. Ever since I got chased away by a big black dog from our cornfield, I just feel like I can do anything now! <clears throat> Where did that come from? I must be getting a sore throat. Oh, we wouldn't want that with your busy schedule. Huh. So, your ladies, they must all get along really well, huh? Uh, are you kidding? Just the other day, I'll give you a, her first initial, K, was screaming at the top of her lungs at J for, I don't know, any, something, to do with red stains on my new pair of jeans and my old blue plaid shirt. Then S was telling them both to cool it. She'll just buy me a new one. But then that made K and J only matter because they thought she was trying to make me like her better for buying me a gift. Oh. Then, I don't know, I couldn't take all the yelling, so I took a walk through the woods. Gosh, 
I must have fallen asleep. Next thing I knew, I woke up, I woke up next to my pond. My clothes were stained again, and I was freezing due to um, oh. uh, the woods being so cold. Yeah, but I figured it was that darn black dog again. Oh. I'll have to see if I can catch the little bugger. Of course, I might have been hunt hunting in my sleep. Oh. I think I sleepwalk. I'll have to see the doc about that. Oh, that sounds miserable. Hmm. Wow. I'll say, I think if I, I got frostbite from something, my back really itches. Uh, you got any lozenges? Oh, sure, yeah. Um, oh, yeah. Thanks, man. Nice audience here tonight. Okay. Okay. Well, um, uh, well, let's get to our next guest. Uh, let's welcome Frost Top from the band Top Tracks. <laughs> hey. You just got signed with a major record label. Congratulations, that's great. Yeah, yeah that's totally true. It's exciting and adventurous, and I get to bring my own personal trainer wherever I go. And of course, my best friend. Yeah. Wow, that's great. So, a uh, personal trainer? Hey. Well, no, they, they only advance me on my classes. Yeah, but I've been training in self-defense. I heard about the weird stuff. Oh, werewolves? And I think they're real. I know. Tonight, a full moon. Oh. Full moon? Why would that matter? Well, according to legend, that is when a, a werewolf transforms uh, during a full moon. People believe that kind of thing. Oh. <laughs> what will people think of next? I have a tough time keeping up with my cornfields. And ladies, who has time for to be gallivanting around as where? Oh, uh, wolves. Oh. I know that. You just howled. I didn't. Yes, you did. No, I did not. Uh-huh. Uh. Okay, for the, for, the, for the sake of argument, I did hear a, a, a wolf howling outside the studio. <gasps> See? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you guys. Oh. Oh, the gooeys. Oh. <gasps> Dude. I didn't do it. Uh-huh. Nuh-uh. <clears throat> so, could you guys cool it? Um, it's my cataplexy. I, I'm sorry. I, I just have to ask you guys, please. Um, when you get a strong emotion, it, it just really affects me. See, I bet it was all your howling. I wasn't howling. Yeah, dude, you were. <laughs> okay. Well, while those two argue with each other, let's get on to our next guest, shall we? Okay. Let's welcome my Uncle TZ. Hey. Is that you? Yeah, it's me. Oh, hello, hello, hello. We were talking to the audience about werewolves, and I remember you telling me stories about uh, when you used to set, uh, you used to go hunting and set these animal traps, or some kind of big traps for, you said, some kind of strange big animal uh, when you were young. Oh, we, oh, big traps, big traps, we, we catch them, we. We catch them all. Solo lobo. 
which means a uh, wolf or werewolf, right? For those of you that don't know, adobo is a really tasty, tasty dish. Sometimes you can put, you know, meat, chicken, you can use pork, seafood, but you mix it with vegetables and some amazing spices. It's just, it's like a, an island stew kind of thing. It's, it's just so good. Mm -hmm. oh, no, no adobo. Go to Bugong. Oh, no, uh, I'm sorry, no, no Bugong. Um, again, for those of you that don't know, Bugong, it's, um, it's kind of like a rotted, well, <laughs> fermented uh, shrimp, kind of, it's a shrimp kind of sauce. It's, oh! Mmm, mmm, oh. 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 I'm sorry, uh, don't, don't get upset, please, sit, sit back down. Will someone go, uh, someone in the studio go and, and get some bagong and rice, please? Just run down to the, yeah, just down the street there's a place, yeah. Great, thank you. Mm, we'll get it. Yeah, yeah, we'll get it. Okay, just, just, uh, it'll be just a few minutes, okay? Sorry, folks, and just a little, little heads up there. Hospitality is extremely important. And in the Filipino culture, it's, it's essential to be a very good host. And, you know, food. Now, uh, Filipino uh, island island philosophy is life is all about eating, drinking, and music, and just loving you know loving life. <laughs> so, um, so for the rest of the audience, what we'll do is we're, we're also going to be setting up a buffet after the show. So anyone interested, uh, just stay after the show, and we'll line up, and we'll all just have a little something to eat. Yeah? Okay. I'm starved. I'll save for a snack. Boy, that smells good. Uh, food's not quite here yet. They're still setting up. Uh, what's going to do my new cologne? Yo, 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 Thanks. I, I've been dieting. I'm trying to get in shape, you know. Mm, yeah, I'll, I'll try some Filipino food. Sounds interesting. Yeah. I thought you said the food wasn't right here yet. I smell... raw steak. <laughs> mm, steak? Lastly, we'll also welcome a, we'll welcome our camera person, Mickey. Hey, Mickey. Hey, everybody. Hey. Uh, yeah, yeah. Hey, Mickey. Hey, Mickey. What a great, oh, yeah. All right, Mickey, good to see you. Yeah. Cool. Good to see you, too. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> So, Mickey, you're always getting a camera's eye view of everything that's going on, right? You ever see anything strange? Um, catch things that maybe we don't see? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well, I think I, I, think I have recently. Uh, well,
But I still can't be sure till I send the tapes in for editing. Yeah. Hmm. Right. Indeed. And to think we had a possible real vampire right here on stage with us last episode. Oh! Oh! We didn't even know. Yeah. And you know what's freaky? He didn't show up on the video on the either. Oh! So you're really convinced that werewolves are real then, huh? Oh, wow, well, definitely. Oh! Jacob go. <laughs> I, I I knew he was hungry. Ah, food's here. So folks, have you decided? Are werewolves real? <laughs> <laughs> so this concludes our show for the night. And uh, for like I said earlier, for anyone that wants to get a bite, uh, go ahead and stay after and. Uh, just form a line, yeah, right, they're setting up, the, yeah, you can see the buffet right over there, huh, looks great too. And for everyone else, we'll come back next time for our uh, next episode of Stereotypical Topics, where we'll discuss the latest A-listed uh, stereotypical topics, uh, the newest, the strangest, or even the more flooring. Peace and love. Boy, I'm hungry. Let's go, let's, let's go Uncle. Oh. 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 I knew it. Oh. Oh. Hey. Sorry, old friend. It's really good. Make us reform vampires, not wet worms! Oh. 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 Silver! That's what I'm telling you! What? I'm coming! That made you move. Oh, this is good. This is definitely good. Oh. 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 So with guitar strings, I spare no expense. Oh, don't worry about our host. He's okay. Ooh.